The Leonard Gates Generation 1 darts as a part of the Windmill 2024 launch have hit the market. I'll be doing an in-depth review of the soft tip and steel tip variations. Gates has been no stranger to us Americans. He's been playing since 1994, a very prominent pro player in the States, winning national soft tip and steel tip events, plus a CDC Continental Cup victory over Dan Olsen, throwing over a 90 average that match. However, he gained worldwide presence back in 2015 when he won his first major soft tip title that was the Darts Live event number three, beating Paul Lim in the finals. Then his UK presence exploded during his June 2022 run at the US Darts Masters, taking down the world famous Fallon Sherrick in the opening round and ultimately winning the North American Championship. His title in Madison Square Garden propelled him into the PDC World Championships that December. Gates drew a very talented young Dutch player in the opening round and very quickly won over the crowd with his dance moves and a huge grin. He even got a USA chant from an almost exclusive European audience. Soldier won the opening round, but then lost to Stephen Bunting in the next round. He took advantage of his newly found fame right into the World Seniors Darts Tour. Leonard started the inaugural event, losing in the semifinals to Richie Hausen, but then successfully qualified via golden ticket and won the champion of champions event in March, winning matches over the legendary Phil Taylor, Martin Adams, and got his revenge over Richie Hausen. He then went on to win the world match play and world masters events on the senior circuit, arguably the most successful 18 month stint in US darts history. Okay, enough about Leonard and those dance moves. Let's go on to a close up of the barrels and then I'll shoot both the soft tip and the steel tip variations. The steel tip and the soft tip versions are nearly identical, except for the overall length and the nose profile, of course. A 90% tungsten barrel for both. I love an onyx coating with milling to reveal the natural silver tungsten. They both encompass the long, straight barrel shape that Leonard loves. The wide space radial bands offset by many little axial cuts provide a very even and intense grip on all surface areas. Overall, we give this barrel a grip intensity of four out of five. Tons of bite going in every direction where you're moving up and down the barrel or if you coil it in your hand, this baby is aggressive. To summarize, Soldier's Darts are a very American classic, long straight barrel with tons of grip. The three most popular elements to a barrel design in the US market are long, straight, and aggressive. So he's definitely serving up something universally loved here with this barrel design. All right, I'll be throwing the soft tip and then the steel tip barrels, and we'll end the video with a summary of my thoughts on how they perform. Okay, 20 gram soft tip barrels, fully dressed. I can definitely do better. I think I did master out. Ah. Oh, terrible miss. I can correct that. Never miss the big pie like I did, but a good correction. another whirl. Woo! Leonard Gates. But we're not going to get the six start out. Just immediately lost my confidence. We'll see.
All right, we'll finish this up and then we'll move on to steel tip. Right in the bottom corner. Oh God. Okay, Leonard Gates steel tip, 22 gram barrel. We did not get it. Oh, try not to trip over my sight right. Still did not get it. We'll switch to some bulls. Such a grippy dart. Okay, we're gonna move on to the 19s because Mr. J Vargo suggested the 116 checkout for our next product launch. All right, let's go for it. 116 out, 19 route. Mm. 78 remaining, 77 remaining. Which means we're just gonna stay on the 19. Ooh, 21, 56 remaining. Oh. Tops for the win. <laughs> I kind of just wasn't even thinking. I mean, never do that, folks at home. Because that's what happens when you take a six year hiatus from playing darts and try to pretend like you know outs again. All right, let's do 116 one more time because I hated everything about that. Seventy-eight. All right, we've had 60 a million times. Ooh, a little close to the trouble. Mm. Double 10 and then we will do a quick summary for you guys. Oh, thank goodness. All right, final thoughts on the Leonard Gates Generation 1 Windmill Darts. The consistency of the grip all throughout the barrel definitely helped me to adapt to such an aggressive um, grip intensity, whereas normally I would struggle because I have smooth hands, so they get caught on really aggressive cuts, but there's a nice balance to this. Outside of grip, I can always shoot a long straight barrel. It is the best place to start for newbies out there, either this or a bomber shape. Uh, but for more advanced players out there, if you have a coil to your throw and you're looking for a grippy dart, this is just perfect all around, whether you glide your hand up and down the dart or spin the dart in your hand. There are grooves for days throughout this for, for reference points. So it's just covered head to toe, an amazing option. And it just looks sexy. I mean, the onyx coating with the silver cuts being revealed, this is a great color scheme. Um, I wouldn't shy away from it if I were Leonard Gates, which definitely seems to be traditionally his preference.
That concludes the in-depth review of the Leonard Gates first-generation windmill barrels. You can purchase these darts on our website, a to zdarts.com. Just look for the links in the description. I hope you all enjoyed this review and the rest of the 2024 launch. Thanks for watching.